Governor Purdue, I know in your budget proposal that um, you sort of spared the market as much as you could in terms of any cuts. Have you any talks with Senator Berger or Speaker tell us about how they're going to treat the market and We've their talked, budget? We, we have talked in general about uh, cuts. I have not talked specifically about the furniture market, but I intend to. I had intended to wait. I have breakfast with them every other week, and so I'd intended to wait until after I came to High Point and had the uh, – the, the metrics in my head about the number of visitors and the number of money and the fact that these investments for the state of North Carolina are critically important. You know, we give incentives, and you've heard me say this before, to a lot of companies from around the world and in this country who come to North Carolina and who want to grow a business and provide jobs. We are in a community that doesn't need an incentive for workers to provide good jobs. They're here. They're our workers. This is North Carolina's industry. We have beaten the globalization challenge and kept this industry whole because of partners like Bill. And so the kind of incentive that we can do as a state is a simple incentive. It's the investment in uh, the marketing and the travel and the possibilities of this uh, furniture market. It's easy, it's simple, it makes great sense. Governor, um, the Klausner management obviously signals commitment to High Point and to the state. We're seeing a resurgence, particularly on the upholstery side, of companies coming back. What, what is your sense and what do you see uh, in the future? Well, you know, again, uh, when I talk with Bill, he talked to me about the vertical integration, that certainly Klausner has a tremendous vertically integrated product where they just, they do the frames as well as the, as the upholstery. I mean, I, I feel very strongly and did even five years ago as we felt like we were under attack. And, in the early 2000s, as globalization began, that North Carolina has a product, our industry has a product that is uh, worldwide worthy. Nobody can compete with the quality of the production. Look at the stuff here at Klausner, all, all kinds of price points. You can get whatever it is your budget can afford. And this is made, manufactured, assembled right here in North Carolina. And so to all those naysayers who said this industry was gonna go away, I say shame on you because we are proving today once again that the furniture industry, this piece of the upholstery industry, the textile industry, is alive and well in North Carolina, and we intend to continue to eat the lunch of any competitor around the world.